Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Minecraft. So, in the last episode, ugh, terrible, well, no, I shouldn't say terrible. Many things occurred in the last episode of Minecraft. Some of them great, some of them not so great. The great things that we may have accomplished in the last episode are that we did come out of that cave with 64 diamonds. That's right, a stack. Now I've kind of, I've got the storage room semi-organized now. I've got a chest for wood. I'll show you where all that came from in a second. A chest for gravel, flint, and dirt. A chest for all the stone things. A chest for the ores. A chest for gems and coal. A chest for mob drops. A chest for leaves, saplings, and other plant-type things. A chest that I have yet to determine what goes in it, but here in the middle, you will notice a chest that says the following. DIAMONDS! It says that. That chest is full of 64 diamonds that for some reason I felt like spreading out across the entirety of the chest and putting a golden apple in the middle. But yes, guys, in the last episode we acquired 64 diamonds with the help of the God Pick. Our Efficiency 4, Fortune 3, Unbreaking 3, Diamond Pickaxe. Now, at the beginning of that episode, however, something very tragic happened. We lost a dear and noble friend, Guy Man. And, um, oh wait, I need to go back down here. And today, I would like to commemorate this episode to the wondrous Guy Man. He lived a, a long, fulfilled life sitting on the front lawn, and uh, yeah, I think I think he was rather happy with his life decisions at some points of, of his of his time. And we're going to today dedicate this episode to him and build him a little um, like grave thing. So now we've got oak leaves, some stone bricks, some cobble, and some dirt. Okay, now all I think we need at this point is some flowers, because we have to give Guy flowers. Everyone knows that. He loved flowers, I think. I can't confirm that he actually loved flowers. I'm just going on the assumption. What kind of flowers, you think? These, these yellow flowers, good? Do we have flowers in the, like, the botany chest? Not the botany chest, but it's got, like, seeds and food and crap inside maybe i haven't sorted out all the chests fully so see these ones still have crap in them but uh yeah we've got some peony and i think the rest has been turned into dye okay well that'll have to do i'm sure he lo i'm sure he would have loved peony do i know what peony is do i know if it's real no but uh i'm gonna just assume where do we want to put his grave. We didn't really have a dog house for him, per se. Just right out here next to the... I think right out here is a good good enough spot. Right next to the citadel. Kind of not really in plain view, but kind of not, you know, secluded where it'll never be seen, either. There we go. See, this looks like a good spot. Guy would have liked it here. I'm sure of it. He never really left our front yard much, but, you know... Uh, all the same, I think he would have liked it. I don't know how we're gonna do this exactly. I haven't- I didn't work out how I wanted- I never built a grave for a dog in a video game before, I must say. So I don't know what one is supposed to do in this type of situation. But, um, oh no no. We don't want grass to grow, that's one of the things that I don't think we want. Because I'm thinking if we do that and then surround it in like cobblestone will that still turn into grass there those two blocks in the middle I don't know I don't know enough about this game to really to re to really to really not to really know no I don't I don't actually know enough to actually understand if that will happen or not do we want to put flowers on his grave or do we want to just adorn his grave with them I'm not sure just I think that looks nice oh why is that lopsided don't be lopsided, flower. No, flower. Stop being lopsided. Your your two friends here are also lopsided. I just noticed that. Alright, you it's gonna have to work. It doesn't look that bad, at least not from a distance. We only got one dandelion. Jesus, guy deserves more than that. 
I think he does anyway. We should definitely light up the area. Um, actually, let's let's head back inside. Let's get a couple of these stone uh, cobblestone walls and make some light pillars. I think Guy deserves that kind of thing, don't you? He was our he was our best friend. He was our only friend, really. Let's get some uh, what is this called? Glowstone. <laughs> I forgot the name. Okay, there should be there's still some crap. Like, as you can see, there's still things, like, in these chests that I haven't sorted out. But I just, I have everything marked as to where it needs to be. So, I didn't need to take, you know, 84 of them or however many I took, but, you know, I did. Okay, well, actually, while we're in here, we might as well sleep so that we don't get bombarded by the dead while trying to bury the dead. That would be, uh, that'd be awkward. Okay, actually, okay, we're going to go back up one more time just so I can check how many bones we have. 57? Works for me. Bet it would have worked for Guy, too. Now, we need a little, we need a chest. We're going to make a double chest and we're actually going to bury something under Guy's grave. Because we don't, we don't have his remains. Unfortunately, we were not able to get our hands on Guy's remains to, uh, properly bury him. Oh, that did not work like I planned. One, two, three, four. Okay, and then we're going to make ourselves a double chest and bury Guy's remains in it. Okay. Well, I say his remains. We're just going to fill it full of bones. and You can either take it as those are supposed to be the remains of Guy, or that he loved bones because he was a dog, and bones are the first thing he ever ate as with me as his owner. So take that however you please. Zombie, if you come interrupt the funeral, I swear to God, I'll cut you in half. You know, that, I mean, I should be, I shouldn't be violent on Guy's day, should I? He wouldn't appreciate me being violent. I don't have a way to get out of here. I just, I just dug my own grave and threw myself into it. Okay, where, where's the cobblestone? Right here. Okay, and then we're just gonna... Fill this with bones. Is this a waste of bones? Of course it is. But is Guy worth it? Of course he is. There we go. See? That was That is a lot of bones, actually. That's like 54 bones. But that's fine. That's what Guy would have wanted. Okay. So now we've got that. Okay, now for the lights. How do we want to light his grave? Two solitary pillars at the ends of like the, the little pathway here maybe wait no that's not what we want I didn't want that I wanted this no you're supposed to go under the wall go under there we go now we'll dig this one out oh I forgot to mention I got rid of all the trees surrounding the citadel that's where all the wood downstairs came from I, I said I was gonna tell you where that was all from and then I just didn't what the what how did the how, how? What part of the world made you think maybe I'd want it to go there? Ugh, ugh, there we go. Okay, this is looking less than great. Um, <laughs> I don't build graves for, for dogs often. Most people don't, actually. Okay, actually, I just got, I just had a sort of idea. Oh, I like that more. Yeah, I prefer that. Okay, than just the dirt. Because then we've got, like, the thing on top to seal his tomb. And then we've got the dirt. And then we've got the remains. That's better, I think. Yes. Okay, we got we got some uh, daisies or whatever they are. Dandelions. Do we want... Oh, wait, wait. Do we, do we want to put, like, a hedge? Does that look dumb? Kind of. But it also kind of looks okay-ish. Right? I mean... We'll give him, like, oh, we can give him, like, a garden pathway. Okay, we're doing that. We're doing that immediately. We'll give him, like, a nice pathway. Dang it, I was really hoping I wouldn't do that. Because now I can't make that block into a path. I don't think I should have to. Yeah, I will have to, as a, as a matter of fact. Oh, great. Now I have to wait for it to turn into grass. Uh -huh. Now do we want... Okay. Next question. The path. Do we want it to just go straight into the, 
the river, or do we want it to go down here and over to connect with this path? That's the question. The question of the of the day, ladies and gentlemen. Is that what we want? I think that looks nice. I think Guy would appreciate that. I think actually we're gonna make these stairs. Do we want stone stone brick stairs? Will that look good there, you think? I feel like it will. Just that way so we don't have to... It, it also makes the path look a little better, because the whole path with the different height blocks is... Does, it just has never looked very good. I'm just saying, game. Okay, I love you, game. I love this game. I don't love that you murdered my dog, but, you know, other than that, I think we're still cool, you and me. So, do we want to make, like, a hedge path? With, like, a gap? Okay. Here, okay, let's see if we can make this work. Uh, and then one right, right there. A gap there, and then one here. Okay. No, 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 no gap there, no gap there. This might look pretty stupid. You know, I think it I think it already looks kind of Actually no, it doesn't look that bad, does it? I think it looks kind of nice. I think guy would like it. Oh, that is not what I wanted to do. Can I place that on the top part of the block and still put things on it? Although if I guess if I do that it's just going to look like a stone brick anyway, so I might as well just put one there. Okay, so we'll do that. And this cuz my thinking is that then we can put lamps lamp posts here of some kind oh and we're gonna need to make a sign I thought I had an extra sign from oh no I put it on one of the chests down there that I have yet to name I think we're gonna put a stone brick there and here too yeah cuz that looks a little bit better are you ever gonna turn into grass or am I gonna have to like I don't know I'm gonna wait and see if it turns into grass cuz I don't know if it will and then a Oh, that's going to get in the way, kind of. Can we make that work without it looking dumb? Or do we want it to just, to just kind of... Oh, wait, wait. Okay, I think, we, I think we put a gap for a lamp there. I've never lit something so well in this game. Or planned to light it so well. But Guy meant a lot to all of us. And we think he deserves this. Or at least I think that we think that he deserves this. So do we want to put another lamp here? I mean, we kind of screwed the every three thing up already. Yeah, we might as I mean, we're gonna put another one. We want the we want it to we want we want Guy's grave to stand out, and we want it to be a memorable uh, thing for him, cause he deserves it. You know, Guy really just he deserved it all. He didn't deserve to die, but he deserves a nice memorial. Please? Oh, I was going to say, why is it not letting me place that? Is that... Uh... Why is it not letting me place blocks sometimes? It's very strange. And I'm not okay with it in any way, shape, or form. And then we're going to build, like, an archway. No, no, I think that, that right there looks dumb. How does how does this whole situation look? Uh, it looks pretty bad from this angle. <laughs> from the from the head-on angle, it looks pretty bad, guys. I don't know. I mean, from here it looks it looks quite nice, I think. Let's put the pillars in with the lamps on it and we'll see if it looks any better. I bet you that it won't. But it's worth a shot, right? I feel like maybe they need to almost be one higher. What do you think? The lamps almost need to be one block higher. I can't decide. Oh, that is not where I wanted you to go. You are desecrating his grave. Get away. This dog <laughs> got the most just baller memorial a dog has ever seen in his life. Well, in his death. You know, it's a, it's a memorial. Okay, leave me alone. You know, from this angle, it looks great. 
and I think this looks good. Oh, oh, we can turn this into path. I think all of this situation looks good. This hall from this angle looks fine. But from from the house, you. Oh, I'm gonna kill him. Hold on, before we do anything, this guy has to die because he is just the most useless useless waste of water space I've ever seen in my entire life. That's right, die in a fire. We'll make, we'll, we'll, whoa, wait a minute. Whoa, am I crazy? Hold on, I have to test something. Sorry, guy, you can, your memorial can hold on. I was getting close to drowning there. Was my screen getting black? Hold on, I'm watching the screen to see if it gets blacker, because I swore when I was about to drown there a second ago, the screen got like, and then when I came up, yeah, the corners and like the sides kind of get blackish. I don't know. From with those there, it doesn't look as bad, but it still doesn't look great. I mean, I think I think definitely get rid of the archway, maybe. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of the archway. At least not made out of leaves. Maybe we can have an archway. Let's get rid of some of these hedges. Like these ones, we don't really need to be here. It can, this, it can just start right here, it can go blah blah blah, and then you go and you can visit Guy. Right? I think that I think that works better than, like, uh, the archway. So now I'm going to put that there and then I'm, I'm going to put a sign on it that says, Guy lived what whatever. Oh, we didn't figure out, oh man, I forgot to figure out which episode I got him in. Okay, I may have to pause the video to see uh, which episode I got Guy in, but I'll, I'll get, I'll, we'll come to that bridge when we need to. Oh, I always take drinks when I lay down for a sleep because it's a time when there's nothing really to talk about, so I might as well. All this talking gets the, the throat very parched. You know, I'm looking at it now, it doesn't look that bad. I'm thinking, I, I don't want to do this because I like kind of having it connected to this path. But I feel like if we got rid of this part and had the memorial just start right here, you know, I feel like it would look better from that angle. So I think maybe we'll do that. Or at least get rid of the hedges in this part. We can just have the hedges start after this. Maybe that's what it is. Also, I'm going to replace the torches on these lamps with glowstone as well. Oh, I don't really have enough, do I? Because it just kind of, it just clashes a little bit. Because the glowstone being blue and the torches being obviously not blue. Did I get seven glowstone from one block? Can that happen? I always thought you got three or four and that was it. Okay, maybe, let's see if that looks any better. That looks better, except for... Th brick pieces don't look great. Uh, I don't know. We'll leave it for now because I think he deserves a nice memorial. So, I mean, yeah, it doesn't look that bad, especially from here. It looks it looks good because you can walk down the path, you can go, you can visit him, blah, blah. The hedges uh, start there and it's all, and I think, I think we're going to leave it just like this. Maybe if we put stairs here as well, it wouldn't look as out of place having stairs over there. Okay, but first things first, I need to go and get a sign. Do I have wood on me? Because I could just make a sign. Is there like stray wood somewhere? Probably not. I like the storage room that we made in that in that episode. Uh, that was a couple episodes ago, so I'm not really sure. But um, it also is very far away from anything and everything. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna just carry some on me. I think would be a wise decision. Okay, I don't need that much. I need, yeah, that'll be that'll be good, cause it's six planks and a stick. Three signs. Three is a really weird number. I don't know why it makes three. We'll figure out something else to mark with these signs. I don't know. We don't really have any other graves. Oh God, if we get more dogs and they die, we're gonna have to extend the graveyard, aren't we? Oh crap, that is gonna be sad. That will be quite sad. Oh, I don't want to have to do that. Okay. We're going to get more dogs at some point, but we're going to do our damnedest not to let them get killed. Okay. Um, 
Is that how we want to start it? Here lies. Here lies. Guy man. And then we will. Okay. Guys, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to figure out what episode we got Guy in and what episode he passed away in so I can mark it on here. I'll be right All right, guys, I'm back. Um, oh, oh, God, we now have to break the sign. All right, let's do it again. Boom. Here lies. Uh, that is the wrong thing. I want to capitalize that just for my own sake. Guy Man. Sounds like a superhero. Episode 22 to episode, what is this episode? This is episode 37, I think. Episode 37. I'm pretty sure that's right. I know it was episode 22 when we got him. I just, I'm 90% sure that this right here is episode 37. All right. Well, you know, all things considered, guys, I think we gave Guy a very nice, um, nice send-off, and I'm quite proud of us, actually. Yeah, we, we gave him a nice hedge-bound, uh, hedge-bound? Is that a term I'm allowed to use? <laughs> Is that a thing that people say? Look, we gave him a nice memorial, and I think it was, it was the best send-off we could possibly have for the wondrous Guy. Do we, should we, uh, should we put, like, hedges here? Sure. I don't see why not. I'm going to break this block. It, it bothers me a little bit. Sure, I don't see why we couldn't put hedges right there. There's no reason not to, right? Yay! Aesthetics! Okay, the, the second uh, little clip of this was actually extremely short, because that's pretty much all I've got for today's episode. We gave Guy a nice memorial, and I'm quite proud of us, guys. So just remember that. Guy will always be in our hearts and in our minds, and in our underground graves. If you enjoyed this episode, please do be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you, um, if you love Guy. <laughs> That's a little cheap. That's cheap of me, isn't it? Whoops. Sorry, guys. Just, just, you know what? If you like the stuff, subscribe. If you don't, then, you know, don't watch it. You're probably not here if you don't. Yeah, leave me a comment down in the comment section about how much you love Guy and how much I'm a great person for building a memorial. I will see you guys in the next episode.